disclaimer. Be advised that I'm not a professional trader or advisor. I am sharing my trading journey for entertainment purpose only. Any opinions, news, research, analysis, price or other information contained in this video is my own opinion and does not constitute investment advice. I will not accept liability for any loss or damage including without limitation to any loss of profit, money, asset or any valuables which may arise directly or indirectly from use of information in this video. Trading foreign exchange indexes, stock market, futures, commodities, energy, precious metal, etc. carry a high level of risk and please trade on your own research and assessment. Please seek advice from a professional financial advisor for your trading needs. Hello my friends. Welcome to Trading KS. <coughs> so today is uh, 25th, 25th of March. Uh, it's a Thursday. Uh. So market slow down uh, today. So market slow down. Uh, Busa also got a drop. Okay, let's look into the uh, other indexes. Busa drop 2.0.291, 4.6 points. Drop back below the 1600,006 level. Singapore today good up 0.356%. Hong Kong down 0.066%. Uh, Korea, South Korea up 0.4%, Japan up 1.142%, Thailand up 0.218%. So, so today the Asian market okay did some of uh, it did rebound. Philippines up 1.293%, but China is still down 0.213%. Uh, uh, China FTSE, China SSE down 0.103%, uh, China SE up 0.103%. Uh, Australia S&P up 0.174. Indonesia down 0.540. New Zealand up 0.236. Taiwan up 0.175. So uh, India Nifty also down 0.806 so it's mixed market uh, today but uh, some of the market did okay did recover so this is not a very bad day okay uh, most is uh, most is green okay except china look at europe to see 100 drop slightly 0.011% uh, dex Drop slightly 0.166%. US Dow Jones down 0.010%, little bit. Uh, SP 500 down 0.5400%. So, Europe and US continue to go down. Huh? So, this is bad for the Asian market tomorrow. Okay, bad for the Asian market tomorrow. Palm oil, good news, up 4.015%. Brand oil, drop 1.723%, uh, 63.3%. And uh, crude oil, drop 0. Uh, 2.027, 59.94. So this one is still below 60. Okay, so this one, the brand oil dropped to 63 from almost to 70 at the top. Go, okay, go is holding. Uh, 1730 uh, down 0.162% silver silver is uh, 0.975% down uh, so the precious metal is down the oil is down okay palm oil is up and the uh, Europe indexes Europe and US is down Asia okay mixed result so look at the counters so today gainers is 437 losers is 493 okay so more losers than gainers look at KLCI so KLCI okay so 1613 okay proved to be resistant okay after broke okay after broke down as a support now okay it's a uh, push the price actually back down okay morning the price went up a bit but at the end of the day being pushed down uh, 
Okay, so unless it can break 1613, possible, okay, bull market. If it cannot break, possible sideways or possible downtrend. Okay, let's wait and see. Tomorrow, Friday, closing. Uh, so let's see how, how tomorrow, Friday, okay, a lot of people will take profit. So let's see like, how, see what, how, how it goes, okay. But nothing much to take profit also, only one day is up, okay, this whole week. One, two, three, four, five. So five, four days is down. One day is up. So not, not, not much to take profit. Look at news. Massing home buyer confidence uh, improving due to immunization. So uh, Massing making a lot of uh, news out. Okay, but their stock is not moving after uh, after the previous announcement of the glove. Uh, so after that, uh, their stock has been flat. Green packet. So green packet say it make a uh, forty nine million gain from G three share disposal. Let's take a quick look at their stock. So flat uh, nothing nothing to talk about, nothing to brag about. So Genting Chairman buy over Genting Hong Kong stake in the Grand Bank Yacht uh, for 62 million. So, so this Genting is very aggressive. Uh, okay, they are buying land, buying, uh, uh, investing in a, uh, in a lot of uh, new, uh, new extension. Okay, so this one long term will bring a good, uh, probably will bring a good result for the Genting. So Genting and uh, or Genting, Genting Malaysia is still on the recovery, uh, on the V-shaped recovery. Uh. Uh, analyze, analyst, analyst cut UM, EMS, UM Sunrise earning forecast and mid luster result. Uh. So be careful, uh, UM, UM Sunrise stock. Okay. Euro holding jump on 4 for 1 bonus issue. So see what happened after the bonus issue. Oh, so climbing up uh, Euro holding. Very strong. Triangle. Looks like price want to break above the triangle but couldn't break. Okay, so you see, continue to see if tomorrow, okay, the price can break up. Okay, can clear break. Have a green candle. This is a red candle, right? Red candle is not a breakout. Uh, you need a green candle to break out. Okay, outside the triangle. So possibility. Okay, the price. There is possibility that, that the price might continue to go up. So this is a uh, start goring really quite. Okay, one wave, second wave, third wave, look like the, oh, this is almost the end, okay, end of the goring, so be very careful, okay, the, the price already, okay, here already goring one, okay, one wave, second wave, this could be a third wave, okay, it uh, could be short lived, so this one, be careful when to invest, okay, so this one, it cannot break up, uh, it will come back down, okay, if you want to invest, euro, okay, uh, euro holding, probably, okay, Look for a drop, okay. Look for a drop to a lower level in order to to buy, okay. It would be better to do so. Okay, probably 2.6 and 3.6 is a better area to buy. Okay, I'm not saying it will not go up. Okay, it might still go up. Okay, but you know, after price already gone so far, or oh, PE value is 2504. Something is wrong. 
it's very overpriced uh, okay so uh, 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 this one okay it's very overpriced most likely want to want to continue to want to invest in this stock wait for a drop first okay wait for a drop then only okay then only go in uh. I add into my watch list in a KLS screener. So Bajaya uh, hit a uh, high on active trade. Okay, on the new CEO uh, after the new CEO come in. Okay, Bajaya actually got uh, uh, do I got Bajaya here? No, never mind. We can open here. So, Bajaya already calling, uh, already fly. Uh, okay, don't, don't chase. Okay, don't chase. Uh. This one is uh, really dangerous. Okay, already how many percent up? 80, 82% up. Uh, so, this is not a good time to chase. Okay. So uh want to chase after 10, 20, 10 percent up, still probably can chase already it's 80 percent, better not chase because you know possible, you know. Okay, sometimes the all these uh boring stock uh, it goes up, it, it, it goes down faster than it, it goes up. Uh, okay. So Usma earning uh, on on uptrend, so they're talking about uh, Usma actually is uh, on the uptrend moving upwards. Take a look at Usma. Okay, still in the still in the channel, uh, so uh, in the, as long as in the channel, okay, continue to hold. So memory gain in micro Malaysia. So it is uh this this news talking about this uh memory chip uh, semiconductor memory chip is having a big burst, a big big demand okay on a uh, on a uh, 2020 okay so uh, so after they deploy the 5G right so these are the uh, 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 industry okay that uh, likely okay going to get uh, uh, get a uh, get a push so it, uh, it got involved talking about the good selling one is the uh, non memory okay the, the the SSD, those are doing the SSD, doing the uh, uh, computer memory chip. Okay, those are the, those are the few. Okay, those are the few market that uh, a few few sector. Okay, few sector that uh, they think they are got uh, good chances. Okay, SP Satir to launch across two Satir Echo Hill. So SP Satir got some announcement. Uh, let's see whether they are stuck. Got follow or not. Okay, so SP Satya is in the range, uh, it's a range, okay, so in a range, simple, okay, buy bottom of the range, sell top of the range, buy bottom of the range, sell top of the range, so this one wait for the price to come down to the bottom of the range, maybe around 98 cent, one area, okay, at the, uh, wait for drop first, okay, then only buy, okay. Kamuda SRS Consulting Analytic Development Island Island A. So this is a project with the Penang, uh, Penang Transport. Okay. So let's see they got the this uh, project award. So let's see what happened to uh, Kamuda. Kamuda, let's see. So Kabunda is still no breakthrough, uh, okay. So you have to wait for breakthrough. Okay, the breakthrough is the price probably, okay, if the price can break.
Okay, break above uh, four ringgit. Okay, probability then only the price got uh, momentum to go out. If you cannot break above four ringgit, so slightly you continue to okay uh, sideways. So look at uh, some announcement. May Bank. So Kumbuna Wang, Pasaraan, okay, buy, starting to buy their stock. Uh. So bank actually, okay, there's a there's a article I think talking about the bank uh, now is uh, uh they are this uh research house right talking about uh, now bank they are putting uh, initially they are talking about bank uh, rating is negative okay means they they don't look good for at uh, means the bank stock right they don't actually they are not bullish on the bank stock but now they put it at uh, a net neutral okay neutral means uh, starting to flat okay so after flat likely there's possibility that, that it can come positive okay so this one and that's why you can see that they starting to all the big funds starting to uh, invest in the bank I think so KPJ so uh, EPF okay dispose uh, KPJ stock 50,000 so uh, public bank okay so public bank but still okay still got disposal EPF dispose okay 3 or 2.9 million also bought a little bit 200,000 so, so there's a mix okay so they are not they are not uh, bullish on public bank but bullish on main bank uh. Aeon so okay Inari so Inari kumpulan bang pasaraan uh. okay continue to buy uh. okay, Inari stock okay so uh, so looks like they are bullish on Inari, but Inari, I don't think much happened to Inari. Take a quick look. This is long term, uh, so they are bullish for Inari. Because this type of big fund, uh, they are not boring, uh, so they are more on a long term holding. Uh, so long term, they are still bullish. So Inari is still okay, now in the channel. Uh, okay, so possible, okay. Still got opportunity. Okay, possible still got money to rebound to verse 3.9. So, SOP, Sarawak Oil. So, uh, this A Gap International PTE. Uh, okay, bought the uh, acquired, bought their stock. Uh, so, SOP, okay, for this investment house in Singapore. Looks like an investment house bought 6.7 million of their stock. So quite a big amount. Okay, I posted uh, a few uh, story in uh, Facebook. Okay, maybe maybe could have a quick talk. Darwin, okay, Darwin actually got some uh, got some uh, momentum today. Okay, so uh, so I put uh, Darwin possible any opportunity to go on uh, five zero five. So take a quick look at Darwin. Uh, Darwin also is in the sector. Uh. Okay, let's talk about the sector. Uh. Okay, today transportation also got some movement, but I don't see uh, any big movement today. Produce, uh, produce so manufacturing got a higher volume, even though it's uh, not.
not so okay you got a uh, 3.6 uh, 3.6 uh, million okay higher volume logistic okay I saw the logistic got some movement but not much to talk about Okay, maybe we take a quick look at this one. Okay, but this one higher volume. So uh, we want to talk about ceiling, Darwin, and uh, Asia Prime. Okay, ceiling. So ceiling the the price already spiked. Uh, So the, the price of this might okay so you see uh, this one uh, okay uh, was on the ceiling was on the downtrend uh, on the last year okay COVID pandemic time so uh, one spike then after that coming down again so this one is having a u-shaped recovery uh, okay we, we, okay the faster one is v-shaped recovery okay but this one is slower one okay slower one is a u-shaped recovery Okay, but it's still having a recovery nonetheless. Uh, okay, so for ceiling, okay, possible. Okay, since it's on a recovery, okay, because the market is recovering, so this is on recovery stock. So this one, okay, it started recovery, it looks like it's developing a channel. Okay, so simple. Okay, wait for a drop at the bottom of the channel, buy, okay, sell at the top of the channel. So top of the channel, wait, it come down, okay, sell top, bottom, uh, sell top. Buy bottom, okay. So this one wait for a drop first. The price already overbought. Okay, wait for a drop, then only sell. Okay, look for the top of the channel to uh, sell. Buy. Wait for a drop to buy. Okay, around zero point two one. Then the selling area okay around zero point three two five or zero point four one five. Okay, so so look for a okay look for a drop and a sell. Okay. Darwin So Darwin today got a rebound uh, okay rebound over here so the price is running in a channel okay in a uptrend channel okay so the price drop down at the bottom of the channel buy sell at the top of the channel bottom of the channel buy sell top of the channel okay so Okay, simple. Okay, if the price drop out of the channel, okay, cut loss sell. Uh. For Darwin. Okay, the the increase of the uh, semiconductor right uh, requirement of the semiconductor right is uh, actually good for Darwin. So Asia Prime. It should price also up 5.4%, uh, okay, ceiling up 10%, 10.9%, and Darwin up 10.67%, uh, so very, very strong, okay. So Asia price, today market is dropping, uh, so all these stock can go up, actually it's quite strong, uh, especially on a Thursday, okay. If the price goes up on Friday, uh, if Friday tomorrow, people take profit, all the price is coming down, right, but tomorrow, still can hold a uh, 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 good uh, those stock that uh, still can hold a good uh, 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 spike right good performance right likely is a okay it's a strong stock uh. okay so this one is your ply 5.5.4 is your ply So Asia Prime beginning it start to run on the channel. So now it broke out a channel, it takes the channel top as I said, right? When it broke a uh, support resistance line, right? Okay, you haven't haven't actually view 
my video on the support and resistance. Remember to view the video, okay? It's important for technical analysis. Okay, when the price actually broke 0 0.355, uh, what happened? It came back down and test 0 0.355 and went up, okay? So this is what we call support. Uh, resistance after broken becomes support. So this is important, okay? So there is... Uh, So the next level okay, of uh, resistance should be 0 0.425, the next target okay, 0 .0 .0 .0 .0 .0 0.475, 0 .0 okay, so these are the okay, target. Okay. So if, if, buy, okay, if buy here, the price actually come back down, uh, come back down below uh, 0 0.355 then this could be a cut loss okay okay so today okay this is the my story and the news okay my sharing for today remember to like and share my video uh, okay remember like and share is very very important for the channel and also remember to subscribe if you are new here every day you get a new video okay to subscribe you get a pop up, okay, and also if you uh, hit, remember to hit the bell, okay, you get a message, okay. So thank you for viewing, and uh, it's already Thursday, okay. So tomorrow coming Friday, so it should be a good great day tomorrow, okay. Stay safe from COVID. Bye bye.